up everybody and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new thank you so much for joining me today here i'm about to change your life maybe not change your life but i'm about to make it maybe a teensy bit better because i have gathered up my random favorite things for like the past few months weeks and i am about to share them with you now, none of this stuff is makeup related. Um, this is a makeup channel, I guess you would say. But since I put out makeup videos all the time, I wanted to kind of deep dive into my other favorites that aren't necessarily related to makeup. I do have some skincare, but if anyone out there wants to see a favorites makeup video, I'm, you know, 110% willing to do that. Um, I just thought this would be a little more interesting and maybe give you some uh, product ideas. I don't know. I just want to tell you guys what I'm loving because I'm. I think you guys will love it too, and then we can all love it together. And I think that would just be a beautiful thing. Um, I don't really know where to start. Like literally, all this stuff is so random. I've been making a list in my phone for like the past few weeks. Like what am I wanting to tell people about that is so great? Um, so I'm actually gonna start with what I am wearing. Um, I want to uh, list one of my favorite things is a online shop called Distressed Vintage Designs. And I believe if I'm not mistaken, they are an Atlanta based company. I think they're based in Athens. But this is like a cute little like crop sweatshirt that I got. I'm really into like, the like lips design um i love this like print i think it's so girly and so sassy and it's just like this gray crop sweatshirt and then this is all glitter and then i have two other um shirts from them so basically they have like really cutesy things um like this and then they have like vintage distressed band t-shirts but the beauty of it is they're not like 70 80 dollars you go on these uh sites for some of these stores that sell like distressed t-shirts and they chart they're charging you like 80 dollars for like an acid wash tea acid wash yeah i said that right an acid wash t-shirt but uh distressed vintage designs doesn't do that their prices are very fair i feel like their t-shirts are all like $30 and below and they do have like a $10 sale tab and if you follow them on Instagram they do like random sales on their Instagram stories where everything's like $10 if you like are the first one to message them I really recommend checking them out here's the other shirts that I have um, I believe I wore this in one of my decluttering videos this is just like a really cute distressed um, not distressed uh, uh, what's this called? acid acid wash guns and roses t-shirt it's really cute and then this one i'm obsessed with i love it it's just like this acid wash tiger shirt i think it's so freaking cute but my favorite is obviously this little sweatshirt right here but they have tons of cute stuff um i really recommend uh checking them out i will leave their website down below um and i am very confident you'll find something you like they also sell like accessories they sell like baseball hats with like um, like the cutout of a Louis Vuitton logo and like this really cutesy stuff like that. So definitely check them out. Kind of just sticking along the line of like clothing items. I'm just going to go ahead and shout out this, uh, these Gymshark sports bras. This is the energy seamless sports bra. Um, I get them in a size small. If you're just wanting reference, uh, I love these. I have been wearing like Old Navy gym clothes for a really long time and no shade to Old Navy they're great and they're very affordable but if you're just looking to like elevate your gym <laughs> your gym athletic wear I definitely recommend Gymshark it's such good quality I'm obsessed with their workout leggings I'm actually wearing a pair right now it's just such a big difference I used to think like oh what like what's the difference in like buying something from like you know old navy workout pants and like gymshark workout pants they stay up i have a really big issue with like when i'm at the gym with like all my leggings rolling down and like they're just not they're not sitting how i like them they're not staying secure i like a high-waisted <laughs> legging when i go to the gym and gymshark definitely does that for me um but specifically this sports bra in particular like i said it's the energy seamless i absolutely love it it's so comfortable and just I really like wearing it and that's about it. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to talk about hair ties <laughs> real quick. Um, if you have an Instagram, I'm sure you've seen these everywhere. 
Um, these used to get, I used to see advertisements for these all the time. They're the gimme hair ties. And I would always just kind of like skip past them because I was like, they're hair ties. Like how, they're hair ties, you know? Um, wrong. <laughs> I absolutely love these. I actually just got these in the mail because I go through them. Um, I had one in my hair just a minute ago. I have very thick, long hair, and even this little guy right here, if I put my hair in a high pony, it will stay in a high ponytail for the rest of the day. Unlike all my other hair ties that like, you know, you start with your hair up here and then it just like throughout the day goes lower and lower and lower. You're not gonna get that problem with these. And they have them for like different hair types. So if you have thin hair, short hair, um, curly hair, thick hair, it literally will like take you through a thing where it shows you like which hair ties best for you. So I have the like all purpose, like for all hair types in this little band, whatever I want to do, like braids because it's thinner. And then I have this for thick hair. And then this is for long hair. Yeah, I, I really like them. They stay in place. Um, that Really, there's not much to say. I'm not going to sit here and be like, these hair ties are going to change your life. But they're very they're very inexpensive. They're like the same price if you would go to like Walmart or something and pick up, you know, a set of hair ties. And there are discount codes. I know some like influencers on Instagram, um, they give them like discount codes. So I'm sure if you just go to the Gimme is that what it's even called yeah gimme beauty i'm so, i suck at this the gimme beauty like instagram page and if you go look through like their tagged photos um there's girls that will post their like coupon codes and i think you can get like 15 percent off and they're already pretty inexpensive like i said um but i definitely think they're worth it i don't have any other hair ties that i've been able to use that keeps my hair in place and i've been talking about hair ties for far too long so we're gonna move along if I didn't say this before, everything that I'm talking about is going to be linked down below. Cool. I'm going to move on to nail polish. So my friend Amanda got me really into Hollow Taco. She had her nails done with like the glittery nail polish and that was it. I was hooked. Um, so thank you, Amanda, for getting me hooked on these. Um, so this is the Hollow Taco glitter nail polish. I do have two of just like the regular colors. I have the black and the blue. These are incredible. <laughs> These glitters are amazing. Of course, I don't have them on right now. I did change my nails today. Um, but I just was wearing the rainbow snow color and it's like this beautiful silver glitter. And it, it doesn't look like how can I explain this? Okay, so this nail right here, if you can see, it's like, <laughs> I did them so janky today, but it's red and then, or pink, I don't, whatever color that is. And then I put just like a little glitter topper on them. That's not what these are. These are a full glitter nail polish and they're so pigmented and beautiful. The only downside is it is such a pain to get off your nails. When I was taking this off today, it took me, probably 30 to 40 minutes just with like the acetone and just trying to get it off my nails. So that was, that's, that's the only downfall. But other than that, I think they're really beautiful and I highly, highly, highly recommend these. Um, I love the top coat and the base coat. The only thing that I would not recommend is the Peely base. Um, the concept is great. Basically what it is, it's a base coat that you put on before your nail polish. And then it just like, pops off like the polish ex itself just pops off and it works but it works too <laughs> too well i did my nails with it and by the end of the day i my all my polish was gone so i think if you are like a nurse or uh, someone in the field where you can't have colored nails and you're going out for the night can't guarantee it's gonna even stay on your fingers for like a night out but I think it's really great for nurses and stuff if you like you can't have your nails painted at work and you just need something quick so I will say that about that okay so next up I'm gonna go ahead and just say this changed my life okay so this is the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian bum bum cream and uh if you've seen people's videos on here talking about their favorite things uh this is one of those i got a sample size for uh my birthday like sephora their birthday 
perk this year is you can choose, I forget what you have to choose between, but the bum bum queen, bum bum queen, but the bum bum cream is one of the choices. Um, I highly recommend trying it. It smells so good. This is a brand new one. I just finished my sample size. You can tell the lid is still on there. Um, I just finished my sample size and I got it in January. So it's March. So it lasted me a few months and the sample size is like really tiny. Um, and I scraped it. There is nothing left. It smells so good. Like even through the little like sifter, I can smell it. It's, it's like a beachy caramel. I can't explain it. It's the most delicious scent and I love getting out of the shower and just like coating myself in it. And they also have a body wash, which I did pick up along with this. I got this in like a little travel set. I'll link it down below if I can find it. It came with this and then it came with a mini body wash and a body splash. Um, I, I'm obsessed with this scent. I love it. And they just, I saw today, they just came out with a perfume. <sighs> so I think I might need to get that. If I did not mention this before, all the products that I'm mentioning are cruelty free to my best knowledge. I I'm like 99.99% .99 sure. Unless like last minute, one of these companies decided to like go to the dark side, everything that I'm mentioning is cruelty free. Okay, so next up is this peeling solution, <laughs> randomly. This is uh, from the brand The Ordinary and it is it is a acid that you put on your face and it's very intimidating looking like it looks like fake blood it comes in this like little dripper and you just put it on your face and rub it in and what it does is it brings all of your impurities up to your like the surface of your skin and essentially will clear your skin um, so I used this for the first time last week. You're only supposed to use this twice a week. And the next day I had these little guys pop up on my chin and I was like, what? okay, cool. Now this broke me out. It's not supposed to do that. But after doing some more research, I learned that this is called purging. When you use an acid like this, it is 30% AHA and 2% BHA peeling solution. Uh, basically what you do is you put it on your face for 10 minutes and it says do not leave this on longer than 10 minutes and then you just wash it off with warm water. Um, so the next day that I woke up, I had these little friends on my chin and I typically break out on my chin when I do have breakouts and it said don't worry about breaking out in areas you typically do after using this because that's all the gunk and impurities coming out to the surface of your skin and basically once it's cleared up, like then your, your skin is clear. And this does make my face feel really soft after I use it, so definitely recommend this. It's like $7, it's incredibly cheap. Um, I It's supposed to be a dupe for a Drunk Elephant product, which is like in the $80, $90 range. So if you are do, like wanting to clear up your skin, I definitely recommend that. They do say if you have sensitive skin, they advise not using this. So use at your own risk. I really like it um, and I just wanted to throw that out there. Okay, so I don't physically have this with me because I got it as a sample. It is the Pure Pore Cleansing Face Wash. What is the name of it? I'm, I'll have it like, I'll put it on the screen right here as I'm talking about it. But it is a Pure from the brand, but it is from the brand Pure and it is a face wash. And I got it as like a little sample packet and my face, I am telling you, has never felt cleaner after washing my face with that. I, my face felt so clean and I could, I could like just feel it working. And that's never really happened with me with a face wash, you know? So immediately after I used that, I waited till the next day to make sure I didn't have like a weird reaction to it. But the very next day I hopped online and I ordered it because it is so good and it should be here hopefully tomorrow. <laughs> um, I wish I had it with me so I could physically show you, but I really wanted to mention that because I loved it like like i said i felt so clean and it was so nice and i cannot wait for it to get here so i can wash my face with it again <laughs> okay so now let's talk about the it's a 10 miracle leave-in product this is what 
<laughs> I really don't know what all this does. I just know that uh, my hairdresser always uses this after she does my hair and it always, it smells so clean and it always makes my hair feel so soft. And finally I was like, why don't, I was like, can I get this? Is this like something you could buy at the store? And she was like, yeah. So um, I went ahead and picked it up. It says it does 10 things instantly. It helps dry damaged hair, adds shine, detangles, controls frizz, seals and protects hair color, helps prevent split ends, uh, helps pr uh, prevent hair breakage, creates silkiness, enhances natural body, and it is a flat iron and thermal protection. So basically what you do is after you wash your hair, you towel dry your hair, and then you spray this all over your hair, and then you brush through it. And I honestly, definitely feel like there is a difference in my hair when I use this. It just feels softer and I notice it's not as frizzy the next day and I, I just really think this is a miracle product and again it's in this video so I recommend it. While we are talking about hair I want to mention the Function of Beauty shampoo and conditioner. Uh, these are my second bottles that I'm going through. They are pricey yeah, it's for what, for shampoo and conditioner, if you're used to paying like drugstore prices for um, shampoo and conditioner, which is fine, um, this is gonna be pricier for you, but these bottles last for so long. And their like whole shtick and what's cool about it is you go on their website and you take like a hair quiz, like what kind of hair do you have? Um, how, you know, what are things that your hair is doing that you don't like? What do you want to see with your hair? Like for me, mine was, um, I wanted to add shine, no frizz. Um, I have an issue with tangles and it basically takes everything that you're saying and it gives you like your own unique formula. And then the fun part is you get to pick your scent and you can also choose unscented, um, fragrance if that bothers you and then once you choose your scent you pick like the level I did a high scent level of the peach flavor and it flavor smell what I chose <laughs> the peach on like the highest level of scent and it is so nice it makes my hair smell so good and I love this shampoo it does really make a difference in my hair and I definitely prefer this over other shampoos that I've used and then also what's really fun about it is it has your name on the bottle or it can say whatever you want. So like this says function of Kendall and it's just like just a little fun touch. Um, but yeah, I really like these shampoos and conditioners. Again, I'll have it linked down below. Um, recommend. Now I'm gonna need all of you to stay with me on this one because I am 1001% sure you've seen this advertisement on either your Instagram or your Facebook or literally anywhere you go. And I thought it was so gimmicky and I was like, that's so stupid. Why would it, it's not stupid. Let me tell you something. These are, <laughs> the Billy razors. Um, this has made my life so much easier. First of all, the convenience of it is like, why didn't I think of this before? How much of a pain it is when you realize that you're like, your razor's really dull and you're like, ah, oh, I don't want to go to the store, blah, blah, blah. So you pay, it's $10 a month. Do you want to know how much money I was spending? on razor blades before this came into my life, I felt like every two weeks I was going into the store and spending like $15. This is $10 a month. And when your first initial purchase, you get to pick whatever color uh, handle you want. And then you take a little quiz or you, tell, you ask how often you shave, um, how many cartridges, basically just ask you how many cartridges a month you want. So I, and then it, it just ships the cart the razor cartridges right to your door. I haven't had to go to the store and buy razors and spend godly amounts of money on them. And they're good razors too. Um, I used to get just like the cheapy razors and it was like two times and the blade was dull and you're done. This I believe comes with one, two, so three. This, I get four blades a month and I honestly could probably go with three. Um, but it's just nice to have that extra one just in case. And it's just so convenient and it's for $10 a month, you really cannot beat that. I think this is such a cool idea and it's just so fun and uh, fun. I mean, how much fun can getting a razor be? But if it was as fun as it can be to get a razor, 
I really love this. I think it's so cool. Um, again, I'll have it linked down below. I just think it's so worth checking out and it's just one less thing you have to add to your grocery list when you go and it's one less thing you have to worry about picking up and it's just the convenience of it. I love it. It's so great and yeah, I've never been more excited about a razor. Who would have thought? Moving right along, I'm going to talk about coffee. So these are two little K-Cups and they are from the brand Grounds and Hounds and they are a coffee company that is really big on dog rescue. <laughs> um, and the the packaging on all their stuff is so cute. If you can see, it says rescue roast and it has a cute little doggy on the front. And this one is the paper and slippers um, flavor. They have tons of different coffee flavors and it comes in a ground coffee too. So if you don't have a Keurig or anything, you can get the bagged coffee. And they are the coolest company. They sell um, mugs and stuff too, and it's all obviously dog related and it's so cute and so adorable. Um, and what's really cool about them is proceeds for everything they sell goes to help an animal rescue. And if I'm not mistaken, the rescue roast in particular, 100% of the proceeds that they get with this specific uh, roast, the rescue roast, 100% of those proceeds go to a charity of that month. So they pick different um, animal rescues, charity groups each month, and then whatever they make through the specific roast, 100% goes to that. And then all their other uh, coffee flavors like a portion of it goes to rescue, but I just think it's so cool. It's like my two favorite things, coffee and dogs. And if you can help dogs and buy delicious coffee, why not? Just for reference, um, these are the two that I get. And I typically drink the Dunkin' Donuts medium roast and I really like these. So that kind of helps. And they have all different kinds on their website. So definitely, definitely, definitely check them out. I think it's so cool what they're doing. Okay, so I wanna talk about this brush cleaner real quick. This is the Cinema Secrets Pro Cosmetics Makeup Brush Cleaner, and it looks like that. And I've used this three times so far, and it's already like almost, you know, all over halfway through. So it goes through everything so quickly. Um, the brush absorbs so much product, but it is so easy to clean your brushes. I can clean all of my makeup brushes in like, 30 minutes with this stuff where I used to uh, take all my brushes into the sink with a brush cleaning solution and scrub every single one. This is so easy and convenient. What you do is it comes with this little tin and you pour it in here and then you just dip your brush like really quickly. You don't let it soak. You dip your brush in the little tin with the solution and then you just immediately take it and you wipe it on a paper towel until it's dry and your brushes are clean. It is so simple and so easy. Like I said, you do go through a lot of product very quickly, but it is to me that it is so worth it because it's so important to keep your brushes clean. Um, it can lead to so much build of a bacteria and it'll make your face break out and it, it really affects your face and hygiene overall. So it's so important to clean your makeup brushes and this is such a little easy way to do it. Um, I couldn't recommend this more. I think it's great. I'm gonna talk about uh, phone cases real quick. <laughs> um, I wish I could show you the case that I am using now, but I use my phone to film, so I cannot do that. These cases are both from Velvet Caviar. This is so cute. This is the one that I just had on my phone. It's all these cute little dogs. And then I bought this separately, but this is also from Velvet Caviar. It is a little ring. It's a little coffee cup and it's so cute. It's like my two favorite things, coffee and dogs. Um, and yeah, I really love it. And I just wanted to put that on there. Uh, Velvet Caviar, they're always running deals. Just a week ago, they were doing like two phone cases for $30. And then before that they were doing like, if you bought a phone case, you got a free little, uh, grippy ring thing. The one that I have on my phone right now is like this, but it's a glass of wine and it's so cute. And here's the other one that I got. It's so pretty. It's like this like marble sparkle. And then this, uh, what do they call these things? Pop sockets. This pop socket is from Glam Obsession Designs. She uh, included this with my next favorite that I'm about to show you, um, but it's so freaking pretty and I had to get a phone case that matched it because, uh, hi, that is 
the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. So definitely check out her website too. And then again, this is from Velvet Caviar and this is from Glam Obsession Designs. And while we're talking about Glam Obsession Designs, look how freaking cute this is. It is a little tumbler with just a bunch of glittery baby Yodas. Yes, I know he's not really Yoda, but let me just call him baby Yoda because that's what I like to refer to him as. This is so cute. Um, she had on her website, she put a picture of this and she was like, there's only one of these. So she only made one of these and was like, I'm putting it on my website at this time. So once it's gone, it's gone. When I tell you I have never clicked faster in my life to snag this, it is so cute. Um, like, it just makes me so happy when I look at it. I don't even know if I'm gonna use this to like drink out of. I think I might just leave it on my, oh my gosh, I didn't even show you guys my vanity. It's built, it's brand new, it's so pretty, and I'm so, so, so happy with it. Wow, I completely forgot. I meant to do like a whole, intro talking about it. Wow. Anyway, <laughs> that's new. Maybe I'll do like a room tour at some point, but yeah, new vanity. I'm obsessed with it. Where was, <sighs> yikes. Okay, so anyway, yeah, this is the cutest thing in the whole world. Definitely check out her uh, website and I'll link her Instagram and everything down below. It's just, it just makes me happy. I love it. All right, so I have some jewelry pieces that I want to show you. I w love these little pieces. It takes a lot for me when I like jewelry, but I won't wear it. <laughs> like I like to look at it, but it's just like, to me, it's just like a pain to wear. Like I love the look of earrings on people and I love earrings, but like the thought of having something like dangling, I don't know. But anyway, I have three necklaces that I am so obsessed with. This one is from Victoria Emerson and it is just this really simple, really beautiful like coin necklace and it's got my zodiac sign on it. I am a Capricorn and it's just so pretty and simple and it's got just like the tiniest bit of bling on it. And I wear this all the time just if I feel like I need something around my neck and I just, I just like it. And it's just so pretty and it's just, I don't know what else there's to say about it, but I'll have it linked down below if you're interested. All right, this next necklace I got from the website, The Sis Kiss. And it is just this really dainty little K necklace in gold. They have the cutest stuff on their website. A lot of their stuff is like uh, personalized stuff. Like you can get your name, your kid's name, your dog's name on a necklace or a bracelet. And they have cute stuff too. They have cute earrings and all their stuff is so freaking cute. But I really wanted just like a dainty necklace with my initial on it. Like, is that too much to ask? And I saw this and I was like, that's the one, that's the one that I need. Um, so I really love it. Um, it's simple, but it adds a little something to the look. All right, this next one is not simple and it is quite wild. <laughs> uh, this is from Crystallized Jewelry and I have so many pieces from them like if you go through my jewelry drawer, it's all crystallized jewelry. And the stuff that she puts out is so cute and so different and so unique. Um, Look at this. It is so freaking cute. It is like a little uh, Rolling Stones homage. Let me see if I can get the camera to pick it up. Yeah, it's this really pretty pink color. They have a red one too and like a yellowy one. Um, but I just, I loved the pink. It's so freaking cute. I saw this and I was like, that is mine. I need it in my life and right now. Oh, it totally goes with my shirt right now. <laughs> um, but it's so cute and the way it lays and it's got like a double chain. So if I can just kind of give you a little, 
Like how freaking cute is that? So it has like a little choker attached and then it drops down on a, another chain and it's the cutest necklace I've ever seen in my life. I think it's so different and so fun. Um, but yeah, definitely check out her website. Uh, I'll have it linked down below. All of her stuff is so unique. That's all I gotta say about it. I really love it. Okay, so that's all like the stuff that I wanted to talk about. Um, real quick, uh, I just wanted to do some like random shout out favorites. Uh, I want to tell everyone in the world about my current favorite TV shows. Uh, one being Jack Ryan. I'm not like an action movie kind of gal or action TV show, but I love Jack Ryan. It is so like compelling and addicting and I really, really, really recommend it. And then also surprisingly, uh, a show on Netflix called Ragnarok. It is a, I think it's like a Dutch, I think it's filmed in like the Netherlands or Sweden or something, but uh, whatever it is, it's dubbed over in English. And when I was first watching it, I was like, oh, I don't, I don't know if I'm gonna like this. Um, it's incredible. It's a little, a little weird, <laughs> but in like a good way. Um, it, it, I really recommend it. I, I, I can't like explain it without giving away too much of like the storyline. And I, I just think you really need to go into watching it with like completely open mind. Um, but it's, it's really good. And anyone that asks me like, oh, I don't know what to watch this weekend. I'm like, you need to watch Ragnarok, not Thor Ragnarok. It's just called Ragnarok. <laughs> so definitely check that out. All right, and then last but not least, I want to talk about my favorite YouTube channels on here. Just when I'm like in a slump or when I'm feeling like meh, these are like my go-to channels. They always make me smile. They always make me laugh. And it's just, they're so, they give me so much inspiration. Um, the first one being, being uh, the channel Glam and Gore. Her name is Mikey and she does these incredible makeup looks. And I just, I love her personality. I think she is so funny. And she is like this incredible special effects makeup artist. And I, I mean, that's not what I like to do myself. <laughs> I don't think I could even if I tried, but she's so talented and just her videos, she's like I said, she's so funny and she just seems so down to earth and she just like makes me happy when I watch her. Um, so I, if you wanna check out her channel, I'll have it down below. I think it's very like entertaining. Next up is uh, Raw Beauty Christy. I think she is the funniest person on the planet. Um, she is so talented and I don't think she realizes how talented she is and how funny she is, which like it makes it even better. Um, she just seems like someone I would want to hang out with. <laughs> um, and that's why I like these channels like Mikey and Christy. Um, they're like just two people that I feel like I would get along with and I would want to be friends with in real life. So yeah, and they just make me feel good. Like I watch their videos and it makes me smile and laugh. And um, yeah. And then uh, the channel, her name is Paige Corin. I like her because she is like, she is like everyone's like best friend. She is just like the cutest little thing. And she is, I don't wanna say like your typical consumer cause she is very talented at doing makeup. But she is, she reminds me of just like the everyday makeup enthusiast. Um, and that's not to say she's just like some, you know, everyday makeup consumer, blah, blah, blah. Like she's very talented and she's very good at what she does. Um, but she does such good makeup reviews and she posts just like really good content. And I really enjoy watching her videos. And she just like, she just makes me smile. She's just so positive and I love her energy. So I really wanted to put her on this list. And if you want to check her out, I will have her link down below. All right. So that is all my random favorites. <laughs> I really hope you like this video. Um, if you are going to pick up anything or try anything, or if you have tried any of this stuff, let me know. We hit 200 subscribers. Thank you so much. That's so crazy. I know it's so small and there's people with literally millions and millions of subscribers on here and 200 seems like such a small number but to me I'm just so thankful and this tomorrow I'm going to be filming my 200 subscriber giveaway video so look out for that um 
thank you so much for subscribing and being here and watching this video and that is all that I have for you today thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time bye